What an awesome start to the season. Next step this weekend uh, is the start of Georgia. I've got a backup backup I can use here, a bow I had when I was a kid. Making me up a new batch of hunting arrows. Left mine in West Virginia. I feel kind of goofy hunting with this little bow, but <clears throat> I have killed quite a few with it in my youth. This is one area that I've always wanted to hunt, and I've hunted the edges of it, but the spot that just there's really not a good tree for a climber in it so I figured I'd try continue kind of testing out the little mobile system. They bed in this thick stuff over here. It's like an old road bed. They cross out into these oaks where it kind of opens up over here. Well, it's September 21st. I'm out here at my little trailer spot. 
fixing to ease in and see if I can see something this afternoon. I was just easing into this blind and I peeked out the, the top window and I could see a deer. I thought I'd be able to sneak up on it and get the camera on it and get a shot. It caught me putting the camera in place. Definitely I'd like to take some trash bags or something and cover these windows. I'm afraid to try to do it from the inside because the uh, floor will fall in but probably take some trash bags and go on the outside and nail them up cover up the windows and make it darker in here. I went and got some Walgreen brand Claritin, but my eyes are just swelling shut. Definitely allergic to probably a few different things in here. the footage definitely looked like my arrow was doing like flips or something <laughs> Did you shoot him? Dude, all right, I'm gonna go ahead and get down. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and get out of this tree and come over there. Dude, I've been praying for you. Come out here today to the spot and uh, to see if I can find my arrow. I didn't find it the other day because I was helping Hunter get his deer. But I think I figured out why my arrow deflected. Found it in the dirt and it's stuck inside a sweet gum ball. So the best thing I can come up with is somewhere between that deer and my arrow was a sweet gum ball that my arrow hit. 
and literally made it bounce off of that deer. So mystery solved on that one because I just don't see how it could have did it after the deer because the arrow is flipping like this. It's not going front forward. I mean, it's like stuck inside that sweet gum ball. So you would have think it wouldn't even have the momentum to do that by that point. So anyway, that's the best guess I can come up with. But that's crazy. I mean, probably the biggest fluke I've ever had when it comes to deer hunting. But actually probably a good thing because the way that deer ducked and where the arrow hit it, um, probably would have been a hard recovery anyway and it started raining just after that. So when y'all hear me talk about Tanner Luck, that's the kind of stuff I'm talking about. Craziest freaking thing I've ever seen.